Hey there, it's Katie. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm really excited to be using this pretty Two Little Bees um, Summer Vibes kit today. I'm just gonna flip through it really quick. I never hauled this or anything. So um, this was a um, like So this little box here was to make up for the error here, where the flip-flops are in the water by accident. Honestly, I probably wouldn't have even noticed that, um, but I think that's cute anyway, so I'll use it, of course. And then we have the full boxes. I love Every Summer Has a Story. I think that's really cute. So I'll just kind of flip through. If you're familiar with the format of Two Little Bees kits, then I'm sure you'll recognize this. Pretty weekend banner, headers, and stuff box checklist and little arrows, headers and little things and washi strips, half boxes, check um, like clipboards, some labels and did covers, and then the really pretty bottom washi and washi strips and labels. I'll start by putting in the to-do headers across the top with these little checklists. And then I think what I'm going to do is put the today headers right beneath the checklists and have a larger today section. Uh, I think I'll do that. So I'm not totally sure yet. But so yeah, I will go do that. Um, and I will speed through this part. Okay, so I got all of the headers and date covers and checklists and stuff in up there. And now I'm going to go ahead and put the full boxes in across the bottom. I think this kit is really fun. I'm really enjoying it so far. So, um, I guess I'll go ahead and do the sidebar now. I already put in the quote box up there, obviously.
I had some trouble getting this piece of washi here down, and I thought at first that this piece of washi was thicker than that one, but actually it's that the planner itself is a little bit uneven. I am pretty sure. Um, because the boxes are like the same distance from the bottom, like from the line above. And so this one actually hangs down a little bit, I don't know if you can see that, but this piece of washi is actually hanging down like the tiniest little bit. Really odd, it's not the kit, I double checked that they're actually the exact same width. I'm just confused. <laughs> so it's definitely the planner. Um, that's a little bit weird, but whatever. So I guess I'll get started going day by day. I don't know that much of what I have going on this coming week. So I'm kind of, I think I'm mostly going to be doing sort of my normal um, structure where I stagger half boxes and stuff across the days. I do want to be sure to kind of cover up these lines here. So I guess I'll, I'll just get started putting things down. And then maybe, maybe I'll just do all the kit stuff right now and then I'll come back um, and like talk through putting in other stickers from outside of the kit. I really love the way that this is coming together. Um, so now I'm going to go ahead and start putting in other stickers as well. Um, I think first I'm going to quickly put in date dots in the days there. In case I forgot to say, those date dots were from Rose Colored Days and they have gold foil. I think they're really cute. I would really like to get um, some foil TV icons. If you've ever seen anything like that, please let me know because I would really like that. Um, because oddly enough, these Planning World icons, which are really cute, do not have TVs on them. So I sometimes use the computers. Um, but I really like a dedicated TV icon, especially one maybe that's just, that's not on a color, that's just like white paper with a little foil TV on it. I think that's what I'm really searching for. So again, I'm filming this on the Friday before this, so it's the 7th here. And I don't really know what's going on in the next week, other than that Big Brother's on Wednesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Um, but I don't really need to write that down. I mean, I might anyway, but I don't need to because I know. Um, but I do know I'll probably be running errands with my husband on Saturday and Sunday. And also we're moving at the end of the month, so we need to start really packing our stuff. We have like thousands of books. Um, I'm not exaggerating. I think we have at least, we have over a thousand at least. I think probably 2,000. And we need to get rid of some of them and it's just, difficult and frustrating. So I'm just gonna put these little arrow stickers from my newest addiction, which are some of my favorite stickers to use. Great like multi-purpose stickers. I'm gonna put these on the weekend to mark some errands and stuff that need to be run. 
I like layering them, lay, layering them over or just putting them in the white space. I think they are really cute either way. I'm going to pull in one of these little duly noted stickers from Clever Girl Crafts. This is the Betty palette with, with gold foil, obviously. I'm going to use this little do it one here to, um, to mark some packing that I need to do on Monday. And I'll just list a few things I want to pack that day. And then just to add some more foil accents, I'm going to pull in uh, a couple of these Sophie Pink bows. These are the Clever Fox collaboration. Clever got Crafts and Fox and Pip. And maybe I'll use some hearts. I think that this color here goes really nicely. I think maybe I'll use one of these hot pink ones. I don't get to use those that much. I think that's kind of fun. And I might, maybe, maybe I'll put in one of these little arrows. Not arrows, um, flags. On some day, let's see where. I feel like I never get to use yellow, but I think the yellow might be a little bit too much for this kit. Maybe not. I think I'm just gonna go for it. I do like yellow, but I feel like most kits it doesn't really look right. I don't know. Put that right there. I sort of want to put one there as well. Maybe the pink one. I need to get some more of these. Okay, so I think now it's time for some Fox and Pip. It is pouring rain outside right now. And I'm actually pretty happy about that because I do think it will help cut down the humidity a little bit today. I have a lot of Happy Mail, planner related Happy Mail coming to me soon. And I'm very excited about it. I had kind of not shopped in a while, um, planner stuff. And I'm really happy to have some stuff on its way to me now. Um, okay, so I just pulled out some Fox and Pip stickers that I think might kind of go well. I'm going to put one of these little Midnight Kiss stickers, which I think she now sells this with just these stickers without the mistletoe and, um, and clock. These were originally released as part of her holiday release last year, but I think now she just has them as a cute little couple kissing sticker, which is really nice. Gonna put that right there. Um, my husband and I have an appointment to sign our lease for our new apartment sometime in the probably the earlier part of this coming week, but we don't actually have the appointment yet, so I don't know when that will be. I'm going to put in one of my custom reader stickers. Um, here to mark that I want to finish reading a book early in the week. And I will put one of these little channel surfing girls. This is one of my favorite stickers for sure. Um, I think she's so cute. On Thursday for the Big Brother Live Eviction. Or should I put that up there? Yeah, I'll do that up there. Yeah, 
if you're watching Big Brother 19, please let me know who you're rooting for. I really don't know yet. I think Kevin is hilarious. I think Alex is a strong competitor. I really don't like Cody or Jessica. Um, I feel so so about them bringing Paul back. I sort of wish they had saved him for an all star season. Anyway, I, I would love to talk to you about Big Brother if you want to talk to me about Big Brother because I'm the only person, I, my husband watches it with me and then I have one friend from grad school who watches it, but I would like to talk to people about it because it's like my life in the summer. Pretty much. That's kind of sad, but I don't really care. It's so good. <laughs> um, so let's see. I'm gonna pull in one of these little checklist, to-do list girls on um, Sunday here. I love that she has a little, like the CVS receipt long uh, checklist. I'll just write in some things I need to pack that day. And then I think maybe for Monday I'll pull in um, a checklist, a checkbox, I mean a, a clip box, or maybe I'll just do one of these. I think I'll go with this one here. And I can just write whatever needs to go there in the white space. And I plan to film a plan as I go video and my traveler's notebook this week. So hopefully I will finish filming that on Friday because I usually will plan Friday, Saturday, and Sunday at the same time um, and put that up on Friday. So I think I'll put this little planner here. Like that. And I'll just write in that stuff up there. So I'm gonna call it a day on this spread. I think this looks really cute. Um, I love using two little bees kits. I think Maria, I think is the owner's name. I think she is so talented at putting together different patterns, um, like the florals, the kind of soft beachy things, and then the like stronger graphic components, like the, um, uh, what's it called? Scooter? Like a Vespa and the squiggly lines. I think she just does such a nice job. Her kits are always on point and really beautiful. So there are icons. So there are icons and deco left over. And I might go ahead and add some stuff in later, but right now I like that this, lo that this looks. I'll be sure to post this spread on Instagram, probably on Monday, that's before the pen, and then I'll try to remember to do um, a midweek on Wednesday or Thursday, and full week, um, like two side by side photos that you can do that on Instagram on Sunday, showing the full week filled out. So I really hope you enjoyed watching. Um, please subscribe if you haven't already if you want to see more content from me. I am planning on filming a haul soon because I have a lot of stuff coming. I just haven't really been in the mood to film hauls, but I think I think I'm gonna be back to that soon. And also, I'm gonna have more uh, traveler's notebook related content as well. So I would really appreciate you following my channel. Um, if you'd like to follow me on Instagram, my username is always linked below or listed below. And um, I really hope you enjoyed watching. Thank you so much for watching, um, and I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye.